So this is our simulator for BIOS. We have here the images. Etong images na to, ito yung kung halimbawa ay naliligaw kayo sa steps na gagawin nyo, what, what is the next step. So, click nyo lang to, double click, and then, ayan, makikita nyo dyan. Yung mga, ano ba yung susunod na gagawin mo, or step by step. And also, meron dito, user guide. Ayan. Step 1, step 2, step 3, and so on. So, here, meron tayong .exe E na extension. The file extension that exe, yan yung pipindutin nyo. Double click that and then makakapasok na kayo sa ating simulator ng BIOS. So, kapag papasok tayo sa BIOS, kailangan natin pindutin ang delete key or F2. Depende sa motherboard ninyo. Okay? So, in this case, we have to press delete key. So, yan. Open ko and then delete key. Once na hindi ko siya napindot or nagkamali ako ng pinindot or hindi naman pala delete key ang kailangan kong pindutin, mag -e error siya. Okay, let's check. Ayan. Iba yung pinipindot ko. So, ang lalabas sa kanya, you are not ready to install operating system. Remember, na kailangan natin pumasok sa BIOS kasi mag-i-install tayo ng operating system ng OS. At kailangan magbubut ang ating system sa ating flash drive. Kasi uh, automatically magbubut ang ating computer doon sa ating hard drive. Pero remember ang ating installer ay nasa flash drive. That is why you have to select flash drive as your first boot. Okay? Okay, so eto na yung lumabas. The bio setup utility. Ngayon, kailangan nating pumasok dito, as I said earlier, para mapalitan natin yung boot sequence. Kailangan ang first boot niya ay sa ating flash drive. Remember that, sa ating flash drive. Now, paano ba natin gagawin yun? We have to select this advanced BIOS features, itong pangalawa. But remember, in the set of utility, we cannot use the mouse. We cannot use our mouse. We can only use the up, down, left, right arrow key in our keyboard. So, let's try. Okay? So, yan. May lumabas na, na box. Ibig sabihin, uh, siya yung pinipili ko or siya yung sineselect ko, the advanced BIOS features. I am using the keyboard, okay? Not my mouse. I have to press enter. Bakit? Sabi kasi dito, uh, eto, up and down arrow key to select the item. Nakalagay siya dyan. Ito yung instruction. And then, save CMOS to BIOS, F11. Save and exit setup, F10. Okay? So, when you need to select, oh, ito na yung gusto ko, ito na yung kailangan ko, you have to press enter. Okay? Now, sabi ko kanina, papalitan natin yung sequence. So, asan yung sequence? Nandito siya sa dulo. So, I will press my keyboard down arrow to go here sa boot sequence. Then, press enter. Okay. Ito na yung ating mga boot sequence. As you can notice, ang first boot natin ay SATA. So, it means hindi ito yung flash drive natin. Yung flash drive ay nasa second boot device. Remember, dapat ang, ang ating first boot ay ang ating flash drive. Asan ba yung flash drive? The USB Kingston data. Ito yung pangalan ng inyong flash drive. Paano mo yan papalitan? S press enter. Habang nandito, no? Sa taas. 
Kasi yung first boot ang papalitan mo. So, press enter. Then, select. When you, when you want to select, use the arrow down key. Okay, alin ba yung pipiliin ko? Siyempre, si USB. So, then, enter again. Yan, napalitan na natin. The first boot now is the USB. The second boot is, of course, ayaw naman nating second boot ulit si Kingston. So, need to press enter again, then select, of course, not the USB Kingston. It's the SATA. So, press enter. Yan. As you can see, we are now done in, in changing the sequence. The first boot is the USB and the second boot is the SATA. So, if you are satisfied or you've done your job, you have to save your uh, changes. So, how are you going to change or to save the changes? Of course, you have to press F10. This one, F10 in your keyboard, of course. So, we have to press F10. Let's press F10. Okay. Nung nag-press ako ng F10, meron ditong lumabas. Are you going to sell, uh, accept saving changes? Y or N? Y stands for yes and N stands for no. It means, pipindutin mo daw yung Y sa keyboard mo kung yes. Kung no naman, pipindutin mo yung N. So, of course, gusto kong isave yung binago ko. So, I will press Y. Yan, and that's it. Congratulations, you are ready to install operating system. So for our next topic, we will discuss how to install the operating system step by step. Kasi ngayon, paano tayo papasok sa BIOS? Yun lang yung ating topic ngayon. So that's it.